everybody. This is Car Maria with Real TV Films. We're here at the 2009 Sundance Festival. And I'm sitting here with a face you might be familiar with, Mr. Matt Sorum from Velvet Revolver. So let's talk about what you're doing here at the Sundance Film Festival. I'm up here uh, like I am every year, doing some party for somebody. Um, but I'm up here with a band called Camp Freddy. It's my side group party band that I put together about five, six years ago with Dave Navarro from Jane's Addiction and uh, Billy Morrison from The Cult and Donovan Leach. And uh, tonight we have uh, Billy Gibbons from ZZ Top playing with us on guitar. Mark McGrath's going to get up and sing a few. Corey uh, from Slipknot, Corey Taylor, cool. is going to come up and without his mask because they wear those crazy, like, but he's an awesome singer, and he's going to come up and do some covers. We do all classic rock songs and punk rock. And uh, Billy Billy Duffy from the Cult's going to play. Steve Jones from the Sex Pistols is here. So just a hot mix of everybody throwing their stuff down. Yeah, it's just turned into this thing. You know, we all like to get together. I mean, a lot of musicians are friends anyway. So I came up with this idea, and you know, ever since then we've been asked to do all these kind of events and parties and and stuff like that. So we go to Vegas a lot. New York, uh, we do all kinds of events. So we're here because uh, Sundance is a party and people want to listen to rock and roll and get drunk and and then maybe go see a movie or two. Have you, right. have you seen a movie? How many Sundance films Hell have you Hell no, I haven't seen one movie. <laughs> I haven't interviewed one person who has, so don't what? even worry oh, about Oh, there's it. movies here? Absolutely. Shit. So where are you guys? Where are you guys playing later? Is this is this a private party or? Uh, no, it should be a big, big kind of free for all. It's Harry O's. It's the Harry the big O's. club up the street. It holds about 1,200 people. So. Hopefully so. We'll be able to get in. Hopefully, I'll be able to get you in. Know somebody. <laughs> so anything, uh, anything new coming up? Anything in the works we can look for you? Uh, Velvet Revolver's been working on songs. Scott Weiland went back to Stone Temple Pilots. So we're going to announce pretty shortly that. Uh, hopefully we have a new singer. Um, is this a secret? Well, we're trying out some guys, so. Very interesting. He's been very, very cryptic about it. Yeah, that's so, what I've been told to do. So keep an eye out for that. <laughs> and uh, Matt, thank you so much for being yeah, with thanks us. Thanks for having me. And uh, you're watching Real TV Films here at the Sundance Film Festival. I got the man from Velvet Revolver. Cool. Can't get any better than that. So, nice. uh, Thanks for having me. <laughs> Have Rock fun. Out. We Don't all drink too much in this high altitude. Listen to the man. All right, peace out. Car Maria from Real TV Films. He's staring with me. <laughs> all right. Oops, shit. I just... Oh! Oh! You didn't kill anybody, did you? <laughs> I just dropped my phone off the balcony. Oh. I hope it's I'll not run broken. down and get it. I hope it's not broken. Quick, quick, before everybody scoops it up and steals all your numbers. I hope that bus doesn't move. Uh oh. Uh, he's coming to get it right now. Thank you. Is it broken? What did you do? I did you put it up on here? Tammy's on her way down. She's Is it coming broken? down to get it. Oh shit. Do you have backup on that? <laughs> Speaking of somebody, uh, how about how about that cell phone? Do you get getting any phone calls? Well, well I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> this was an expensive interview. If yeah, I gotta go buy a new BlackBerry. Pretty expensive. Uh, Is it still working? Oh my Damn. gosh. T-Mobile rocks. Can we do an advertisement hey, for them right I, now? I'll tell you what. I'll tell you oh what. Oh my I bet, god, it's on. I'll it's tell you on. what. That's my dog, Miles. I'll tell you what. iPhone couldn't have made that drop and lived. Right before we did the interview, man. Babe, I dropped my phone off the can balcony. We, can we show the drop? And it lived. <laughs> you filmed that, didn't you? T-Mobile, awesome. ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. You did a great job. I'm glad your cell phone's still working. Good job, Excellent. Excellent. You rock. I want to come see you guys play. Deep inside the monster pit, hot soul.